put it laid on where it belongs and I'm going to keep some pressure here and just get started with my taking the, the little peel piece here that covers the new sticky and I'm going to start it this way and put this into place where it belongs and then I just kind of keep this going because everything's all lined up across here and that way I keep it right where it belongs in position and at the end then I have it completely done. Smooth it out and it's ready to go on this part. Now we work on the top end to finish the job. This is probably the more challenging one to get it connected here because I want to get a good fit of the banner right up against the rounded portion of this uh, top cross piece. And again, uh, in this case, the adhesive is already on the new cross piece. And so I'm going to just take it loose part way so that I won't tend to get this stuck in the wrong place. So at first I line it up here to see about where I want it. That looks like where it ought to be. And now I'm going to take some of this loose and put it underneath out of the way. And I'm going to get the first part of the banner secured where it should be. And once I have that done, it's a lot easier to work with the rest of it here underneath with that piece of covering and gradually work it back little by little. So now I'm going to bring it up here where I can control it better. Take a good look on this side here. And then be able to do like this and move the tape back, the little tape covering back as I keep pushing it into place. And it's quite easy to control it this way. And there I have it all the way across. Now we have the new banner secured. I will now hook it back on here so that I can go back down and finish my job by putting tension on the whole, whole banner, remove the key, and start to roll it back up and put it away with the new banner on it. And I can take it loose here and have it put away. And we're ready for service again.